Welcome back to White Mountains Today. I'm here with Charlie Lavery. You're the head chef at the Snow Village Inn, and this is Max's Restaurant, correct? Yes, Max's okay. Restaurant. Okay, and so um, you guys have some incredible food, clearly, um, as, as you've brought in to show us. Thank you. And, uh, and you guys have some really great events going on, so, um, and not just for the tourists either. You actually also uh, cater to the locals, it sounds like, on Wednesday nights. Yep, definitely. Um, uh, locals night's a big thing for us. Uh, it's one of our busier nights, and uh, I, we put together uh, special menus and specials uh, every Wednesday. The price point's a little bit lower, uh, usually based on New England style rustic comfort food. Nice. And it's for the locals to come in and uh, just experience the space and eat our food and drink our craft cocktails awesome. and yeah, and just hang out. And it's a it's a great place to be on the Wednesday right. for sure. Um, and then. So and your winter hours are a little bit different. So Wednesday, it sounds like it's Wednesday through Saturday. Yep. So um, through the winter, uh, we do 4.30 to 8.30, uh, Wednesday through Saturday. Yep. And um, come in for cocktails at 4.30. Uh, we open the restaurant at 5. Um, you can sit at the bar. And we're always running uh, cool specials and always changing everything up. So Awesome. Yeah. And, um, and so... Uh, you also have what are these five dollar apps on Fridays? Yeah, so a new promotional thing we started doing. Uh, it's pretty cool. Every Friday, uh, starting at four thirty, uh, we have a menu of five dollar craft cocktails uh, as well as five dollar appetizers um, that change here and there. Um, there are things off our regular menu, some new different stuff that we like to do, and uh, it's a good deal. I mean, you can come in and. For under twenty dollars, you can get a that's, martini and a couple really yeah. awesome appetizers. Yeah, that's so. really awesome. Yeah. I, and I can fill up on appetizers, so I'd be all oh, over definitely, that. Oh, definitely, definitely. <laughs> and usually, if you get, you know, you get a couple of them, and you're probably going to want to get a couple more, just because yeah, yeah. they are only five dollars. <laughs> exactly. So, yeah, it's a hell of a deal. And then um, it sounds like you get some of your seafood um, from Maine, actually. Uh, yeah, I source. We source most of our seafood from Maine. Um, we use a couple different companies. Um, Maine Shellfish being a big one. Okay. Uh, Harbor Fish being another out of Maine and some other uh, even smaller uh, fishermen uh, that we use. Mostly line caught day boat seafood. Um, we bring, I bring it in, try to bring it in almost every day. Wow. Um, yep, yeah, and um, we specialize uh, in our oysters. They're a big thing for us too. Yes. Uh, we do f uh, fresh oysters, uh, mostly from the Daramascata River. Wow. Um, which, uh, in my opinion, are some of the best cold water oysters in the world. That's so, awesome. Yeah. And what they call it, outrageous oysters. There we go, on Thursdays. Yeah, uh, Thursday have, that's night's special. another promotion that we do. Uh, we actually call it the oyster orgy. Um, <laughs> so it's a little bit provocative. <laughs> but it's, uh, it gets people's attention, But it's right? a great event. Yeah, you come up and you get low-priced oysters, uh, different seafood specials. and. Okay. So if you like oysters, it's a place to be on a Thursday. Nice. For sure. And then, um, and so you've got a new kind of monthly thing going on and the first one coming up is the barbecue and beer theme with the Tuckermans yep. which is a great beer company to pair up with. They're, yeah uh, best in the area for yeah. sure. Uh, back in October um, we did a family style harvest dinner that went off really really well and everybody enjoyed it so we decided to start doing these monthly kind of themed family style dinners. Yeah. And the first one coming up um, is February 9th and it's uh, the theme is beer and barbecue Okay. Um, which is kind of a cool thing in the winter. Yeah. Um, and we paired up with Tuckermans they're gonna supply the beer and we're gonna pair it with your classic um, barbecue meats and accompaniments. and Yeah, who doesn't like that? Yeah, and it's, a, it's cool. It's a flat rate, and uh, you just come, and we just serve you food and beer, and you'll be full and yeah. a little buzz when you leave, yeah. hopefully. So. I mean, I think a lot of people, when they go up on the mountain, whether it's hiking or skiing or whatever it is, like they're looking forward to that meal when they get back down on the mountain. Yeah, exactly. And that's where you guys would come in. I think so. I think so. I think it's going to be a really cool event. We hope, uh, we hope to fill up for it. Um, it. It's definitely one that you don't want to miss. So. And so, and we, when we were talking earlier, you said you've been cooking now for 17? Yeah, I'm approaching years. 17 years, That's give or impressive. take, of professional cooking. I yeah. know, it doesn't <laughs> seem like that long, but when I really break it down, it's been about 17 years. All right, so. and so tell me a little bit about what you brought for us here. Oh, yeah, so I um, brought you guys um, an appetizer and a dessert, um, both new menu items. Uh, the appetizer, it's a, a savory style Tuscan bread pudding okay. um, with sourdough, um, a sun-dried tomato custard, yeah. Um, some Fishbowl Farms greens, uh, oh which are hydroponic God. greens that I source from Maine. Oh, really? Um, yep, pickled onions, salsa verde, and some Parmigiano Reggiano. Oh, my God. Just to kind of finish it. <laughs> um, it's a delicious appetizer. It's a new menu item. Um, so, so, like, are these things that you could get on that, like, $5, like, some, app and uh, drink, sometimes. some of them? Yeah, yep, yeah, sometimes, yeah. sometimes. Okay. And uh, the dessert awesome. is a new one. It's um, a mason jar layered trifle oh. um, with Luxardo cherry. Um, Chocolate, dark chocolate crumble, vanilla pastry cream, and toasted almond. Oh my God. Yeah. My so. stomach is rumbling. <laughs> <laughs> this looks amazing. So, um, 
so this this is kind of an idea of you know just just a sampling even of what to expect when you're coming in. Definitely. Um, and I mean, I actually believe it or not, personally haven't been in, and now I'm definitely going to be. <laughs> yeah, you got to come up and you check know, it you out. You see the you see you know even the Wentworth. I had been in to the, there finally at one point in the game, but um, but honestly, I. You know, you, you see those places and you think, oh, that's for the tourists. You know what I mean? And you don't realize, like, that there's the stuff going on for the locals inside. Yeah, no, so we, nice we like to you're, cater to everybody. Yeah, I mean, our doors are open house. for everyone, yeah. for sure. Locals, everyone alike, for sure. That's so. awesome. So, um, so, yeah, I'm looking forward to coming and uh, and trying some of this delicious food. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Did we get a shot of both of these? Because these are amazing. <laughs> um, so, I don't know if you guys can see, but... Uh, like a beautiful display here that he did and he came in and did it like all on the spot within like two minutes he just like got it all set up here and i don't know if you can see into this dish oh okay he, you've got the close-up because i'm like this is fantastic and then the dessert and then after we go on break i'm just going to scarf it all down before we hit the next <laughs> Well, it was a pleasure having you on. Yeah, Charlie. definitely. It was, it was good nice to be here. To meet you. Yeah, you and, too. And um, I'm looking forward to coming in and trying some of this delicious food of yours. Absolutely. All right. Um, and if people want to find out, if do you have a menu online that people Absolutely. can look at? Yep. You can go to Snow Village and website, uh, Max's Tavern uh, menu, and all the information is on there. Okay. So. And then it's, is it snowvillageinn.com? I believe so. Okay. Yes. Or if not, Google Snow Village Inn. <laughs> uh, make it's sure there. you check it out. The food looks fantastic. I'll try it and I'll confirm with you after this break. <laughs> make sure you stay tuned. We'll be right back.